Today, we are winging it. We're showing you five different wing recipes that you'll be hard pressed to pick a favorite. From curry to classic, from Asian to Italian. You just sit back, relax, and don't worry, because we got you under our wing. <laughs> That's right. Come, Come on, on in. We're We're good. Good. <laughs> so I'm Chris. And I'm Wesley. My Deborah Winger Loon. <laughs> I don't know why I, I love that. Deborah I Winger. I do too. I do too. I love terms of a dear man, <laughs> yeah. officer, and gentleman, urban cowboy. That's I heard she makes a great wing. So you know, but we're gonna make even better wings. That's awesome. awesome. That's awesome. <laughs> so let's get down to recipe number one: Italian style wings with gorgonzola dipping sauce. These wings are based off an Italian classic lemon chicken dish. Oh, and they're made even better with some homemade gorgonzola dipping sauce. <laughs> the dipping sauce is worth the price of admission. It's worth it dipping is, into. Yes, I'll tell you that. But just so saying, good. But these wings are to die. I so love let's it. Talk about oh. Them. Okay. These things have been marinating all day. We, we, start, we marinated the start of them early in the morning. You can do this Woo the night before, but they are so flavorful. Um, so w what this is, it, let me tell you what this marinade is as you, yeah. as you take them out. I'm going to dry these off as he's talking about yeah. what these yeah. are in. So if I can remember clearly here, so you're going to get yourself a nice large bowl, and uh, lemon is a key component here. So we've got the juice of two juicy lemons, um, and then I'm going to take those lemon halves, and I'm going to uh, cut them up into portions and throw them in the bowl. And then we're going to add a tablespoon of olive oil. Uh, I've got a couple of cloves of garlic that I've minced that I've thrown in there. And then I've got some fresh herbs. We've got fresh rosemary, oregano, and sage. A tablespoon each of those. Those all go into the bowl. And then we're going to add a about a, to the half a teaspoon of cayenne pepper and then a nice healthy pinch of salt and pepper. We're going to whisk all that together and then we're going to put those wings into that incredible marinade, get them all tossed up and get them nice and uh, flavorful and then put them in that 9 by 13 dish and then we cover it with plastic, stick it in the fridge. You can do this for an hour minimum, but if you can, the longer you can do it, the better. The, um, we did it, I don't know, we've been making these for a while, and the other day we actually, we actually let them marinate for, for, two, for days. two days, and they were great, they were fantastic, so you can't go wrong with that. Okay, so now we're gonna do the double cook method. We're gonna fry them up first to get them nice and crisp, and then we're gonna finish them off in a really um, hot oven. Ooh, so I've yeah. got my oil here, at 350 degrees Fahrenheit, and these are gonna go for a total of eight minutes. Uh, about halfway through it, I'm gonna flip them over um, just so they get equally crispy all over. Yes, and just so y'all know, I'm drying these off a bit before they go. Hold on, Chris, I didn't do a pat. Okay, okay. So I'm drying these oh, off. That, that's the second batch. Yeah. Okay, we're doing these in batches. Okay. I'm just gonna stick this over here, because then I gotta get started on the, um, the gorgonzola, the gorgonzola sauce. sauce. Here we go. Get this out of the way for yes, you. Yes, please. I'm just going to maneuver these out of the way. Kind of clean it up a bit. There we go. <laughs> help me out here. I am Long helping way out. Okay. And if you don't get these completely... Oh, I put in a couple of those. Yeah, that's all right. We're not going to deep fry <laughs> the lemons. Okay. You're going to make gorgonzola sauce. Yes, y'all. This is wonderful. This oh, that's is... already smelling so it good. It is so good. So I have got... Oh, hold on. Let me just get them all together so I don't have to reach for so far. I know. Okay. It's okay. such hard work being I know. alone. I know. I know. Oh, look all at right. my chicken over here. Okay, so I have a spoon. I got a big spoon. <laughs> I've got three quarters, no, three fourths a cup. Mm -hmm. A uh, right three fourths a cup of mayonnaise. Good quality Good mayonnaise. Good quality yeah. mayonnaise. You can make your own if you want. <laughs> And then, I ha how are those doing? Oh, they're doing great. They're already getting nice and crisp. Wonderful. All right, so I've got that third cup of mayonnaise. I've got two tablespoons of, these are celery. I'm like, what are those? It's chopped <laughs> celery, yeah. <laughs> those green things. A tablespoon of garlic, minced, minced garlic. garlic. Oh. Get in there, people, get in there. And then I've got a tablespoon of, is that a tablespoon? Yes. Okay. Oh, no, that was two cloves of garlic, and this is a tablespoon. It's going to be about the same oh, thing, okay. about a of, tablespoon. Of chopped onion. Yeah. Gosh, this is so good. God, I didn't realize it's so packed full of stuff, Chris. Oh, yeah, well, that's why it's so yummy. And then I've got a quarter cup of heavy cream. What? Yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> crazy around here. We're wing nuts. Um, yeah. All right. And then I've got a four-ounce package of gorgonzola. Crumbled gorgonzola. Oh, 
Gorgonzola is like this amazing blue cheese. It's so good. It's very similar. This is this is a kind of like a blue cheese dressing that you normally have with uh, wings, but this is a little change. And some uh, salt. So good. Pink and some salt. pepper. And did you do that? Oh, and a little hot sauce. You can't forget the hot sauce. Yeah, that gives just a, little, a couple of just dashes. A little zing. How much, Chris? Just a few, like a few. There we go. Few dashes, I yeah. gave it a, I gave it a few more dashes. Good. That's good. Normal. And I'm just gonna mix these up. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to stick it in the refrigerator and let it chill. Is that what you're going to do? That's what I'm going to do. <laughs> well, okay then. All right. Well, <laughs> Call I'm me gonna... Deborah Winger. I'm going to stick those in the fridge. <laughs> <laughs> you are winging it. Okay. So I've got these are looking good. Um, they are so getting so nice and crispy. Let the, these probably got about another four minutes to go, and then we're going to take them out of here and we're going to do the next batch. That's right. Okay. Oh wow. Look at the those, those look are, those are on the way to being super crunchy. I know, I know. They're already <laughs> pretty crunchy. Crispy crunchy. So uh, what we just like I said, we let those go. I did them in a couple of batches, eight minutes, um, turn them around every now and then. Just be careful, that's hot oil. And then I use my tongs to remove them and put them on this cook uh, baking rack in a cookie sheet. A baking yes, because we are gonna Stick it in the oven. That's 420. Do you want to do that now? Yeah, go ahead. Because right. we're we got this set for 425. We're gonna do this. We're gonna cook these for about 15 minutes. They're 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 pretty close to being cooked now, but we're just gonna finish them off. And while yeah. I'm make, making this sauce, this sauce is uh, it's got some of the same ingredients that we had in the marinade, and so it's just really gonna complement those wings. That beautiful. lemon in there. Yes, it's so heavenly. So good. Okay, so I've got I threw in one tablespoon. We're gonna add more butter here in a moment, but one. One tablespoon of unsalted uh, butter, and I am going to now add to this. This is we like it good and garlicky. This is six cloves <laughs> of minced garlic um, that we have sauté or that we're going to sauté, and it's going to be. This is just such it's a so good. Oh, this is already smelling so good. I love it. Okay, so now we're going to add in some fresh. Er well, no, we're going to add in some lemon juice, uh, fresh <laughs> lemon juice. This is the juice from one. Lemon, because we love lemon. Yes. And then I'm gonna get this other half. Oh, the smell. You could throw a little white wine in here, and that would be Ooh. delicious too. Um, but this is so loaded with flavor. Okay, so now we're going to add. We got some fresh herbs. I've got a tablespoon of what we used before. The with a tablespoon of fresh oregano, rosemary, and sage. Yeah. Oh, the flavor. Right now, I've really got that cranked tight. Okay. Now <laughs> we're going to add the traditional. We're going to give it that wing flavor, and this is two tablespoons of cayenne hot pepper sauce. Uh, Frank's Ooh. is very common. Uh, what we use. Yum. I know it's so good. And then we've got um, a half a cup of good quality chicken stock. And I'm gonna add just to give a little. If you want, I, we like a little zing to our wing, <coughs> wings. Woo. A little zing to our wings. So I add a, a nice pinch of red pepper flakes. Okay. Now we're gonna let this come to a when simmer. When do you put the butter in? We're going. I'm oh. gonna do that in just a moment. <laughs> I'm gonna let this simmer uh, for about four minutes, and it's gonna reduce just a little bit. And then we swirl in the butter, and it's about that time the wings will be done. And you know what we're gonna be doing. Mm-hmm. Oh. Okay, yes. those are ready. So my sauce. Oh, these are sizzling. They are sizzling. Yeah. Wow. They're gonna be. Those are gonna be nice and cool on those, my tongue. Yeah. Look at those, you guys. Oh. Woo so the, anyway my sauce I let this simmer in it started to reduce a little bit which is what I wanted about four minutes and then I put, uh, put my remaining three tablespoons of butter in there and then um, I put um, a good healthy pinch of salt and a healthy pinch of pepper and um, that's all it needed and, yeah. you know, these babies I would help you but I don't have that's, another pair of tongs. that's okay I got it okay. Chris. I'm doing it fast as I'll get out. You're doing good. Race against the clock. I know it. I know it. I know it. I know I it. We gotta eat these, these well, wings. I'm actually. I could let them cool down a bit. I know so you I could let them cool down. Should take my time. But that's okay. But uh, hold on, hold. Uh, <laughs> He's Gosh. getting a good workout. Okay. Okay. All right. Now this is my favorite thing: to do. pouring the sauce over the wings. Isn't that beautiful? That color of that sauce is, and then all that garlic, Yum. all that. Watch out, Flo. All of that delicious garlic. Okay. Flo's now, like chicken wings. I know. I want some. Okay. Now we're going to toss these in that beautiful, gorgeous sauce. Yes. The smell is enough to uh, absolutely drive you 
through the roof. It's phenomenal. I'm so tempted to just dump these. Oh, okay. But I'm going to um, just bring these over here. Yes. And start, but you, there's your beautiful gorgonzola. There's that gorgonzola. It's good. All chilled and delicious. It's good and thick. That's what I like about it. Oh, wow. Okay, Chris. Okay. Yes. Aren't these amazing? They are. <laughs> Look at the steam. <laughs> I'm going to start blowing on them. Yeah. <laughs> I know. I know. We do this all the time, and then. Okay, I'm trying not to make a mess. I know, I know. That's all right. It's wing time. I know. We're, and you get messy with the wings. You definitely do. And then I'm going to drizzle some of this sauce right over the top. Oh. Because it's all about this. You know what? Let me move this. Okay, go ahead. I'm just, oh boy. Come on up in there. Oh, 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 mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> yep, we'll save a little just for sopping up. <laughs> <laughs> um, paper towels, I think, yes. would be much needed. Oh, yeah, that's a given. Oh, well, I should have got us little plates, too. <laughs> you, you, I always, that's a recurring theme yes, around here. I know, I know. All right, leave them there. Might okay. need them. Yeah. Okay, y'all, these are hot, so <laughs> wish us luck. Ooh, wow. These are so gorgeous. I just love these. I got to put a little. The gorgonzola will help cool them down. Yes, got to put some of this gorgonzola. That gorgonzola. It's so chunky. I love a chunky gorgonzola. I do too. <laughs> it's dipping sauce. <laughs> okay. Okay. Ooh. We're going in, folks. <laughs> oh. Wow. <laughs> I'm dropping my drop. I'm, I'm messy. That is amazing. Oh, oh the flavor. I. I'm in heaven. <laughs> y'all, y'all. Is that not the, the herbs? Oh, the lemon. The lemon, oh. the, oh, the garlic. It's not too much of anything. It's oh. just such a beautiful, beautiful flavor profile. Wow. Oh. Wow. 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 <laughs> These are amazing. <laughs> and I'm gonna say it. Okay. They're 100,000% Luna Pro. <laughs> yes! <laughs> All right, folks. Now on to wing recipe number two, teriyaki chicken wings. These wings are a little bit sweet, a little bit savory, and a whole lot of good. Ooh, they're good and sticky and finger licking good. <laughs> that is so, oh my gosh, they these are good. so good. These, are, these might be my favorite. I, I don't know, know. We say that every time yeah. about everything we I do. Know. But anyway, okay, <laughs> let's get going. So I've got a tablespoon of olive oil that I have got in a medium saucepan over medium heat. And to this, I'm adding a tablespoon of minced garlic and a tablespoon of minced fresh ginger, Yum. one of my favorite favorite things in the world. And this is with. this is a sauce that's going to go over these. This wings. is a sauce that yeah, we're going to I've got I'm getting started on this sauce. The so top wings. All right. Us. Yeah, look at these guys. You're my wing man. I, <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay. Mm -hmm. Keep them keep, keep them coming, Chris. Keep I'm, them coming. I'm, I'm going to. I, I, I'm just winging it. That's all I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I've got 2 pounds of flats and drumettes. Um, what I did was I salt and peppered them. Uh, thoroughly on both sides, and then I got another um, uh, another bowl, and I threw in the, and threw in that bowl. I, what did I throw in there? Garlic, a uh, tablespoon of minced garlic, a tablespoon of ginger, and then a half a cup of soy sauce, Yum. and then a tablespoon of sesame oil. Yeah. And, and then I threw those wings in there and I mixed them all together, <laughs> and then I transferred them to a nine by thirteen dish and uh, got them all evenly distributed, covered them with saran wrap and shoved them in the fridge. <laughs> and every once in a while, like maybe, these have been in there for about four hours. We did this this morning. So we, about two hours, we just mixed them all together again. Just to kind of get them, get them evenly good, distributed. Yeah. Look at that though. You, Those can do, you can do that the night before. You can all, if you're rushed mm. for time. I know, it smells so good. It if smells good, but it doesn't look good. Raw chicken doesn't look well, good. Well, just, just wait, just wait. <laughs> so if you could do that overnight, or you could, if you're in a pinch, we've done it where you just do it for an hour. But um, anyway, okay. Anyway, now. we're gonna bake these, and I'm gonna throw them on this baking sheet real quick. No, well, that's a good place to put yeah. them. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna continue building this the sauce we're gonna and we can make the sauce and then let it chill until we're ready to toss them with the wings okay this is a, and you're gonna see a lot of recurring 
different flavors throughout here, which is good. That's a half a cup of soy sauce. This is a half a cup of mirin, which is like a sweet Asian uh, cooking wine that is so good, so flavorful. Uh, like I said, we've got the savory and we've got the sweet. sweet. And then we're going to add, I love the addition of this. This is a quarter cup of pineapple juice. Um, so good. I just love teriyaki. Teriyaki uh, ter so Teriyaki anything. Teriyaki I know, salmon, I know, I know. teriyaki Chicken, whatever. anything. Yeah. I know. Okay, so now we're going to do, oh my gosh, that smell already. Oh, teriyaki tuna. Teriyaki tuna is good. <laughs> um, okay, so now I'm going to let this c come to a boil, and um, all right, do, do I've got my thing started? My yeah. So we've got our here. oven preheated to 350 degrees, and these uh, bake for a while. They're going to bake for 50 minutes, and um, and then this sauce. So this sauce has now come wow. to a boil, which is lovely. So I'm going to make something here that's called a corn starch slurry. And I'm just going to add a little bit. Of, it's like a slurry. A slurry with a fringe on top. Yes. And um, so what that's going to do, that just acts as like a little thickener. And we want to kind of thicken this sauce up a little bit. So I've got a tablespoon of cornstarch. And I probably added a little too much water, but that's okay. You want to do like two tablespoons of cornstarch and then about a quarter, about a tablespoon of water. And um, let's see. Do you just add that in there? And it just just thickens it a little bit. It's going to reduce yeah. down a little bit. We're only going to let this cook. We're going to let this simmer for 15 minutes, and then I'm going to take it off the heat. You can put those yeah, in. Yeah, I'm going to stick these in the oven. Yeah. All right. You see how that's already thickening, and the smell is so so good. Okay. So those are going to go 15 minutes, and then we're going to baste them with this. Yeah. Oh, the smell is just. Oh my God. It is uh, very intoxicating. <laughs> <laughs> that is for sure. Look at that, y'all. Isn't that beautiful? I love baking Yay! wings. I mean, frying them, of course, is fabulous, but look at in the smell. Oh my gosh. All right, I'm gonna crank the heat back up here while we do this. To, we're gonna crank it way up to 425 degrees. Now, remember, I've got my sauce here that's thickened, and um, I've, so I've taken it off the heat. So now let's put these into Ooh, this. Give me the big tongs. I know. Well, <laughs> you're grown up. You, it's time you get the big tongs yeah. in life. It's about time. <laughs> Finally, I get the big tongs. Wow, you guys, these no. are going to be so sticky and delicious and delish. sweet and okay. savory and all of the above. So now we're going to take, we're just going to pour half of this sauce in the bottom. Just eyeball it, but you want to do oh, one of my favorite things in the world. This is my favorite thing when making wings. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay, yeah, that's enough to make you salivate. Now, are you, why, what are you doing with the rest of that sauce? We're gonna brush it on at the very end. Oh. So we're gonna put these back into a high heat um, oven and they're gonna get kind of caramelized. Are you kidding me? I forgot that you yeah. had to do that. And oh. the, what do you mean that I had to do that? Uh. <laughs> It's a I just joy. Want to eat them now. I don't know. We're gonna make them, make them even better. So now we're gonna put them back here one more time. I know it's 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 um, brutal, but it is. but it's worth it. It's gonna get them really sticky and and kind of charred a little bit. And that all of that brown sugar is gonna really caramelize. And <laughs> it's it's just gonna be something that you're gonna want to get out your notepad and write home about. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. All right, okay. I'll get my notepad. Okay. All right. So, oh, Chris, right. this that's it's, it's very, very hot. All right, we're still this is still preheating to okay. 425. <laughs> Don't pick that up. It's I very hot. Did. He always does that. And then we're gonna only let them go for like 15 minutes and then and then we brush yeah. a little more off and then, and we, then we're gonna be on the wings of love. <laughs> Oh, it's the moment we've been waiting for. I love this. Oh, wow. <gasps> Did I not tell you that these things become just like a work of art? Those are, those are gonna be hot. I know, <laughs> well, th that's okay. So now I'm gonna, I've got, I saved some of that sauce and I'm going to, you know, because we always love oh, sauce. Oh, wow. Isn't this amazing? <gasps> So these ones that I've already done, if you want to start. Oh, uh, sorry, I'm just mesmerized, I know you're mesmerized by them. Aren't they incredible? I mean, they're so, that in the smell, that teriyaki is just. Oh, you guys. I'm so, oh, I know they are, wow. they're gonna be piping hot, but that's oh. okay. That's, that's why right. we I'll have. I'll take one for the team. Yes, yes. We, that's why God gave us lung in our wings. <laughs> Lungs in our wings. What, what are you talking about? Breath in our lungs, <laughs> so we can blow on our wings. I can't speak, I'm, I'm verklempt because oh, of these. Chris. I know, I know, silly me. Wow, look at that. I know you guys, so this is, we've served these. Oh, come on a little closer We've now. served these um, two guests before and people just flip for them. I mean, it's like, I've heard people say, yeah. this is the best 
Yeah. Not just the best wing, but like the best appetizer they've ever they had. They are. Which is a bold thing uh, to say. Amazing. Put that one right there. Here, Chris. Put that one right here. Right there. Right there. Okay. Right there. Okay. There okay. It is. <gasps> you all. <laughs> now, we got some, uh, just some like nice toasted sesame seeds just to give a little. <laughs> right up. And these are so succulent and so, you know, saucy. You don't need to dip with these. I mean, you could, but why bother? I. Wait, hold on. Let me get these. Oh yeah, we need paper towels. Yes. Yeah, Ugh. these are these are these are a little messy. Yep. Let's get ready. <laughs> <laughs> you guys. I didn't. I still didn't get you a little plate. Ah, oh, that's okay. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna take this guy right here. Take this beauty. Oh wow. Ah. Okay. Here, hold on. Yep. <laughs> so blow on him. Oh. Oh. Mm. Wow. So perfectly cooked. Wow, I just had the mouth wide open. I know. That flavor. You guys. I mean, that, uh, that, it's like this mm. savory, nice salty and sweet. But sweet. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh. I would recommend when you serve these to your guests, let them cool for a minute or two. <laughs> I can't stand it. <laughs> that is so good. Mind-blowingly good. Mm, okay, I gotta. You gotta, you got I gotta tell you guys. What do you gotta tell us? <laughs> I told you their finger looking good. I know. Mm, these are, hold on, <laughs> finger looking good. Mm. I think they're 100,000 percent Luna Proof. Yes! <laughs> okay, it's time to move on to wing recipe number three: garlic parmesan wings. These wings bring together two of our favorite flavors: garlic and parmesan cheese. These babies are a guaranteed crowd pleaser. <laughs> they, are. they are. They please the heck out of us. Oh, them. they're so good, y'all. They're so good. They're so good. All right, let's All get right, going. Let's, let's get, make so, them. Yeah, so so we're gonna put these in a marinade first. So I'm gonna quickly whip that together. Do it. Ooh, look at me whipping things you together. You're such a whippersnapper. I've got a tablespoon of olive oil here, mm -hmm. and then I'm gonna use the juice of a lemon. Yeah, oh, these are, are tough I lemons. Know, they're, 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 hey, that's a tough lemon. I know, they're not very juicy. Yeah, look at that. Oh, okay. look, they don't mix. <laughs> <laughs> All right, one more little. Okay. Sorry. Oh boy. <laughs> Things slow down when they come over on this well, side I'll of the table. I tell you, we'll eat at some point. <laughs> All right, so I've got the juice of one lemon, and then I have a tablespoon of. Ooh, that's rosemary. I <laughs> that's can tell. fresh rosemary. That's, I can tell well, that. I just we like to go with some fresh herbs just to give it that the depth of flavor. You could use dried if you want to. So good with yeah. the fresh. And then I have a tablespoon of. Fresh oregano. And you can use whatever herbs you've got on hand. We, we have these three. Then some thyme, a tablespoon of thyme. We had plenty of thyme on our hands. Yes, get all that good thyme yeah, out of yeah, there. Yeah. Then I have some cumin, which is a half a teaspoon. Mm -hmm. Dry there ground we go. cumin, yum. Then a, ta is that a, ta that's a, no, a tablespoon. Ta that's a tablespoon. <laughs> a teaspoon of, of salt. salt. Yeah. And then a half teaspoon of Pepper. You got it. And I'm just gonna mix this together real quickly. This out of your way. Thank you. Oh wow. The smell. Those aromatics. It's very aromatic. It's very aromatic. We'll get to the garlic and this. the parm in a little bit. Yeah, all right. This so is just to flavor those wings. Let's bring these wings over here and just pile that in there. Look at pile that. Pile it in. Oh yum. Yum, yum, yum. Oh, can I borrow those? Yes, okay. they're for you. Oh, thank you. And you're welcome. And I'm just going to mix these, get these good and coated with the olive oil mixture. Yeah. Or the so this just gives, gives, gives the basis of a good flavored Ooh. wing. You really want them. So we're going to do a kind of... Two, did I say these are two pounds? Two of pounds of the drats and, and the flats. Yeah. yeah. Party wings. Um, so we're going to do... I always say you can cook your wings any way you want. These we love to get them super, super crispy because they're going to have that delicious coating on them. So oh, we do a combination yes. of we fry them and then we finish them off in the oven. Yes. It's really, really great. And, and you, we're going to let this sit 
for about oh about a half an hour. We're gonna let it chill. You can. Yeah. We're in a hurry. We want to eat these because <laughs> they're so good. But you could you could do this um, the night before. Let them marinate overnight. That's really really. I good. didn't really need to change cover them since they're. Yeah, you be do. Bit it's it's always good to do that. You don't want the fridge stinking up. All right, let's okay. let these chill. Okay, chill. Okay. All right. My oil is ready. We've marinated our wings. Chili wings. So chilly. <laughs> They've been chilling out. Oh, those oh, look, look so at good. those. Oh. So, <laughs> okay, so I've got my oil preheated to 350 degrees. You could do this in a deep fryer. Um, a trusty um, instant read thermometer really helps you make sure you know you've got the right temperature. Um, and I'm going to have to do these in batches, which is okay. They're only going to go a total of eight minutes. Careful. And, um, I know. That's, uh, we don't want to overdo it. Um, I think that's it. I think we've reached our limit. <laughs> that's okay. So we're going to let this go for eight minutes. They're going to get nice and crispy. They're not going to be completely cooked because then we're going to finish them off in the oven. But we're going to do these in two batches. Okay. Look at those. Look at those. Oh, and those are, here, listen, you can do it. Here, the scrape, scrape, scrape. <laughs> no, you didn't hear not it. really. No, but trust us, they're yeah, crispy. Take two. Anyway. <laughs> they're crunchy. Uh, so we... Um, we put these on when you start. We put those in it for eight minutes, and then at four minutes, we flip them over because you want to get them good and fried on all sides. <laughs> and then uh, after eight minutes, we f I fish them out and I put them on uh, this cooling rack, and we're going to then stick these in the oven for 15 minutes just to get them really crispy. You want to finish them off? They're going to get totally delicious. Super that duper crispy. Super duper. All right, you do that. <laughs> Did you say 425? Oh, 425. Okay, 425. <laughs> yeah, it's a yeah. nice hot oven. <laughs> um, now we're going to make this amazing sauce. So I have got, you know, wing sauce is just, I think, the most common ingredient in wing sauce is butter. And that's probably why we love them so much. Um, so I've got a whole stick <laughs> of unsalted butter here. That's right. You and are the wing sauce beneath my wings. <laughs> the wing sauce. The wind you, wing sauce. You've been something waiting like, something I, that didn't quite work out. But anyway. All right. So while that's melting, I'm going to go ahead and add some other flavor enhancers. This is two tablespoons of cayenne pepper sauce. That's um, it's that's what's really common in wing sauce. Uh, this is what we love to use is Frank's. Frank's, Frank's is we traditional. We put that blank on everything. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> and then we got a quarter cup of just good old chicken stock. And now we're going to add some seasonings. I've got a teaspoon each, one of onion powder and one of garlic powder. Oh, the smell is already smelling like wings. Wow. And then I know, um, you, you inhale it and it starts to make I know, you. and it clears your sinus. <laughs> yeah. Then I've got a teaspoon of salt and I've got a half a teaspoon of black pepper. And this is going to town, which wow. is good, the way we want it. Now, you're probably wondering, okay, when are we going to see garlic and when are we going to see Parmesan? Half of that is about to happen right now. So I've got three <laughs> big old cloves. You want to like a good, put as much as you want, but I like to say at least a heaping tablespoon of, of garlic. Yes, you oh, need some garlic in there. That's right. Oh my gosh, that smells. Yeah. So I'm going to turn this down. Then you can make out with your girlfriend or boyfriend after you eat all that garlic. <laughs> yeah, and, and, then, and then, you know, have a nice break after. Yeah. But at least you ate good. Um, so anyway, so we have been making this for a long time. A friend of, a colleague of mine from work years ago, she she came when this was soon after we had started the vlog. She yes, said, I love garlic parmesan the pizza. wings. We love you, new pizza. And so I said, I've never made them before, but I'm going to come up with a recipe because they do sound delicious. And so I played around with it, and uh, they became These, like one of our instant yeah, favorites. As soon as football season starts, we start making wings. I mean, we we are wing nuts, yeah. you could say. <laughs> Okay, so those are only going to go about 15 minutes, and these are this is going to simmer about 15 minutes, and then we bring it all together with some parm cheese. And we eat them. Yeah. Oh my gosh, the smell. Yay. All right, these okay, are those ready. Are ready. Yes. Those are good and punchy. Oh, and crunch, crunch, crunch. Crispy, crispy, crispy. Oh, those oh. are beautiful. Okay. Um, I want to. I love them just like. What do they call them? Naked. Yeah. <laughs> you like them <laughs> without anything on them? Yes. <laughs> look at that, you guys. All right. These are perfect. They are so. Well, I'm just starting here with I know. <laughs> well, they look good. Actually, I got to get rid of that. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So my sauce over here has been simmering on low. The smell is um, intoxicating to say the least. Okay. Now, wow. I'm all right. So excited about this. Look at this. Look, and you see those all that garlic. Hold on. Wait, Chris. I gotta. You ought to yeah, I gotta participate. Be, yeah, I gotta be a part of it. Okay, you. I know you. Would. I'm here. I'm All right, here. these are good. And these are gonna be good and saucy, folks. Yeah. <laughs> Does that look just amazing? Yeah. All that garlic. 
I love it. I do too. I, this is one of my all time favorites. Thank you, Nafisa. Look at that. Isn't that amazing? Oh. Okay, so now, oh, there's all that beautiful sauce down there. Now, for the final touch, oh. we've got a quarter Here, cup. Let's let people see. We got a quarter cup go. of Parmesan cheese. I'm gonna just do this kind of in increments. Yes. Um, just let that coat those chicken wings. Isn't that beautiful? Oh. I know, this is insane. <clears throat> this is truly something you could, you go to like a gastro pub or like just a killer. Oh. Killer good restaurant, and uh, they'd be hard pressed to produce something this yummy. I just salivated. I know, I know, I know. I okay. just salivated. I did too. I'm gonna call you Sally Salivator. That's good. <laughs> okay, Chris, set these up right here. I'm bringing them over. Yes. I like your little setup here. Uh, well, a little, you know, a little butcher paper. A little ambiance. Uh, is is always... No, it's like sandwich paper. It is. It is. <laughs> oh, these are so great. You guys, pile them right in there. I know. And these, again, we, we keep saying they're perfect for game day. They're great for parties. Uh, people just, people will flip. I'm I mean, I'm flipping. I'm flipping. I'm flipping out is Guys. what I'm doing. I know. We are winging it, baby. I can't tell you. I know. Now I'm going to just, I'm just going to really be bold here. Yes. And I'm going to. Here, I'm going to get this out of the way. Yeah, let's, let's go for it here. <laughs> and then just drizzle a little more of this over the top. Because, you know, why not? Yeah, don't waste that sauce. It's hey. all about that sauce. Oh, it's the Parmesan, yeah, it's the garlic. garlic. Wings are meant to be a little messy. That's why we've got our paper towels over here. I'm so excited. Ah. <laughs> now we've got here, Wesley's got here on, on the side here, our homemade blue cheese dressing. Yes. You could, these are good with homemade ranch. They're good with, they're good by themselves. But we do like to put a little, um, blue cheese on them. This yeah. is my homemade blue cheese. You gotta ooh, make it, it's ooh. so easy. These are, these are hot. I know. You're gonna be, that, that blue cheese will cool it down. Yes, look at that, you guys. Look at that. Oh, wow. A little blue cheese. Go ahead, Chris, grab a yourself. Little. Oh, I'm just slopping it all oh, over the place. That's an understatement. <laughs> okay. Oh my goodness. Oh, I, I just, my mouth is watering. I should have given you a little plate or something. That's okay, that's all right. <laughs> Going to my mouth. All right. Oh my. Oh my. I mean, oh, that's ridiculous. Every time we make these, we're like, mm. I think these are my favorite. Oh. That's amazing. <laughs> I know. I know. Yeah. Garlic and oh. It's yeah. the combination of it together. It's not too much. You know, I mean, I know people who are like, I don't like that much garlic. <laughs> these are my favorite till the next recipe. <laughs> wow, y'all. These are 10,000% Luna Proof. Yes! <laughs> now on to the fourth wing recipe. Grilled curry wings. Perfectly grilled wings bathed in an amazing curry coconut sauce. Oh, you better snatch these up before they're all gone. <laughs> amazing. Oh, these, these are epic. I'm they telling you. Unbelievable. Curry and chicken wings together. Forget it's about it. It's a match made in heaven. All right, yes. let's get going. All right, let's get these things seasoned up. So I've got, uh, this is what we're going to put on the wings before we go out and grill them, but I've got a teaspoon of smoked paprika. Yum. Let's get that out of there. And then I've got some garlic powder, another teaspoon. Mm -hmm. Then I have a teaspoon of salt. Okay. Got to have some salt in there. You do. And then I've got a little half a teaspoon of pepper. Oh. And I'm just going to mix that together. This is just going to give those uh, the wings just the basis of some flavoring. Uh, we've got two pounds of our good old party wings. Those yes. are flats. Here they are. Flats. Party wings. Wings. Drumettes. <laughs> and then. And then I'm just going to sprinkle these over real quick. Yep. Yep. A little bit at a time. And then I'm going to mix it up. What, Chris? <laughs> <laughs> So delicate. I'm sorry. Is this mine and this yes, mine? Yes, okay. yes, 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 yes. <laughs> so we've got our grill. We're going to grill these um, because we just love grilling wings. You can cook them however you like. If you like them really extra crunchy, which is great and is traditional, you can certainly um, fry them as well. Uh, but you just want to get them cooked. So we're going to grill these to perfection. Yes, I actually, I kind of like the grill. I do too. It yeah, gives, why don't you help me out? I will. Here. I'm just standing here watching you. Um, 
Oh I love God. the grill too because you get some of that little smoke flavor and it's it's uh they still get nice and crispy and they're super delicious. Yes, and it's still nice enough to grill outside. <laughs> uh, speaking of which, I'm gonna take these out right now. Okay. So what, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put them on indirect for 10 minutes and I'm gonna switch them over to direct for 15 until they're super delicious. He's talking about indirect heat. Oh, yes, yeah. Well, what else would I be talking I about? I don't know. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go do this. Okay, go! <laughs> So he's manning the, the wings. Now let's make this unbelievably epic, delicious sauce. So I'm gonna start off with a cup, and I'm sorry, a quarter cup of unsalted butter. And I've got a medium saucepan here that I'm gonna melt over medium heat. And um, to this, as soon as that melts, we are going to add some curry powder. This is my homemade curry powder. You may be thinking, wow, that's too advanced for me to make. It's so much easier than you would than you could believe. I make it and then I just store it and we have it throughout the year. It is so good. All you need is like a coffee grinder or a spice grinder and um, the all of the herbs that go into it are so easy to get. A lot of them you probably have in your pantry. If you don't, you can get them at the grocery store. And I'm telling you, it is, I mean, the, the you know, the purchase stuff is pretty good homemade is always going to be better and it's just so amazing all right now we're going to start amping up these flavors that's two tablespoons of good quality of curry powder and then i'm going to add a teaspoon of flour and what that flour is going to do is just we like the this sauce to have a little bit of thickness to it um, not as thin as say some of your other sauces for other wing recipes. Um, you just really want it to coat it and uh, it just has that amazing Indian um, chicken kind of feel to it. I just love it so much. It's incredibly good. So I'm going to turn this heat down just a little bit. Now this is coconut milk. This is unsweetened coconut milk. <clears throat> this is a cup. You can find this. It's easy to find in the Asian section. Uh, most uh, supermarkets, no problem. This is fish sauce. Now fish sauce is so easy to find. I find it at my local grocery store. This is a tablespoon. If you can't uh, get your hands on fish sauce, you could use soy sauce in a pinch. And then this is chili garlic paste. Love this stuff. It's so great. There's some heat to it. So you gauge how much you want. If you like your wings on the little on the spicy side, I go with two tablespoons. We like them with a little heat. So that's two tablespoons. If you like less heat, then just go with one tablespoon. It's not, they're not overly um, hot. Also just be aware if you're using store-bought uh, purchase curry powder. Some are hotter than others, so check to see if, it, if it's mild, medium, or extra spicy. And let that kind of gauge how, um, how spicy you want this. But isn't that beautiful? It's just so... And if you could smell right now, oh my gosh, those wings! Oh, are going to be perfect for this. So we're all right. We're going to let this simmer um, for about just until the wings are ready, which are going to be probably another 10, 15 minutes. Oh, they smell. I know. <laughs> and that, oh, I that know. smells amazing. I know, I know. Oh, y'all, look at that. I love it. Look at the little char on I those. I know, I love grilled wings. <gasps> y'all, I did 10 minutes indirect heat, and then I flipped them over to 15 minutes direct heat, and then I flipped them once again. Oh, Chris, calm I know, down. I know, I'm getting excited. <laughs> and then I flipped them once again, like around seven minutes. Um, and they're just, just and keep an eye on them just, because sometimes they get a little, uh, the flames start to flare up. And you know. I can hear the, the, I can hear it like the crunch right now. I know, I know. Can I, can, yes, you do. Yes. You so my sauce it. over here is, well, I'm just helping you along. So this, this sauce is so beautiful. You see how it's slightly thickened. I let it simmer just on low for about 15 minutes and it is ready for those <laughs> wings. I mean, I've never, this is. This is a unique wing recipe and it is... It's the best! I, when you first made it, I was like, I, I don't think all, I want my wings I, any, I know, any way else. All right, all right, all right y'all. This is, a, this is a, what they call food porn, so get ready. <laughs> there we go. Chris, move that. Um, there you go. Wonderful! How's that grab you? 
Yum. I know. Give okay, me all this that. Is my, this is, and these are, these you definitely, we got our paper towels out here. You definitely need them because these are saucy. Just like Wesley. <laughs> Good. And I am. I'm feeling a little saucy today. A little. <laughs> You're saucy every day. All right. I'm getting set up for the I'm wings. So the most amazing wings on the face of the planet. I'm, I'm just beside myself. I can hardly wait to eat these. All right, Chris. I'm ready for you to lay them down. Okay, I'm gonna lay down the law. <laughs> All right. This is gonna take a couple minutes. Um, anyway, you yeah. can. Oh my gosh. These are so good. These are so beautiful. Oh. oh. That sauce. I know. You know, he's made this a, made these a few times and they get better yeah. every time. Well, I'm telling you folks, if you if you feel the urge, try your hand at making homemade curry powder. It's it's easier it's, than you think. And it's delicious. Isn't the sauce just amazing looking. Wow, y'all, look at that. Look. <laughs> I made it a little spicier for you today mm. because you said the other day, yeah. I wanted a little You know what? You can do. What can I do? Add a little more sauce. I know, I need a spoon <laughs> to do that. So I'm gonna use a tablespoon. Oh, there you go. <gasps> okay, that's um oh. that should be Ill <laughs> illegal. Okay, so wow. now Y'all, I'm so excited. <laughs> the perfect little touch to this. Oh, oh Chris, your your pile is falling. I know. We got a <laughs> quite a pile here. This is chopped cilantro. Um, you can leave it out if you don't like cilantro, but it really complements the flavor uh, profile here. <sighs> Okay, I don't know what else there is to say other than oh, dig in. Let me um, let's clean yeah, this. Yeah, let's. Uh, all right, okay. I'm ready, Chris. I, well, I'm gonna have one. Y'all, it's a it's a paper towel roll day. Yeah, uh, I'm no, gonna no, have no. it at the ready. Oh, Chris, I think I need this one right here. My mouth is watering. Guys, look at that. Look at how wonderful, and that's gonna go right into my. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna grab this leg right here. Oh, oh wow. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's nothing better. Oh, y'all. Wow. Oh. That is comfort food. You got it all over your face. That's the way I like it. <laughs> mm. You guys. Unbelievable. That is. That is the coconut and the curry and then the little spice from that chili paste. It's, I'm beside myself. That's amazing. And this is 10,000%. percent Oh, y'all. So now, let's go to the last but not least wing recipe. Classic buffalo wings. This classic wing recipe is the one that started it all. They're so scrumptious and made even better with homemade blue cheese dressing and a side of celery. That's <laughs> right. Oh, you'll feel like you're a buffalo, but without the cold weather. I know, I know, it's right. <laughs> so this is our take on the, the classic buffalo. Uh, they, it originated at the Anchor Bar in Buffalo. We're gonna do what we think is really close to the yes. uh, our interpretation of it. If you're from Buffalo, and we do something wrong. Don't yell at us. Don't scream and holler at us. <laughs> We're trying. This is our version of it. So, but we I think we, it. we it tastes really good. So we got uh, two pounds of party wings. They're the drumettes and the flats. And I'm gonna make just a, a very basic seasoning. These are really they're not real like extravagant or anything. They're just simple and delicious. So, so good. A teaspoon of kosher salt, a half a teaspoon of uh, black pepper. I'm gonna add a, a half a teaspoon of smoked paprika. I've got a quarter teaspoon, oops, I oh, a, little, no. a, a little less than a quarter teaspoon of uh, some cayenne pepper. I was worried it was a little too yeah, hot. Yeah. And then I've got a half a teaspoon each of garlic powder and onion powder. Um, just to give the basis of these wings the flavor, it's really all about the sauce. Um, I can, you know, I told, told you that we've gotten yelled at before. We, we <laughs> really got raked over the coals because the first time we did these, we, um, we battered, well, we put a layer of flour, flour. on this just because, you know, it, it gives another kind of additional layer of texture. But we we learned, um, boy, did we yes, learn we that learned early on. that is not the way you do it um, up at the anchor bar. You do not flour. It's just the, it's the wings and we're not messing around with anything else than this good old yeah. deep fryer. We got, we got the papa deep fryer That's right. we're not, this one. We're not going to bake we're, these babies. Yes. We're not we're not messing around. That's these, right. We are going to cook them um, the way they should be cooked. So anyway, these um, I'm just kind of mm. mixing this all yeah. up so they get nicely coated. I'm trying um, to clean up. 
up. I appreciate the mess that. that you've made. Well, you know, <laughs> the wings are meant to be messy. Okay, so now you I, you got some plastic wrap over yeah, there. Yeah, I mean, uh, you don't have to do this. You could put these in the freezer. I mean, in the freezer in the fryer <laughs> immediately. But uh, I like it to chill for about 30 minutes. Just kind of let that seasoning really sink into the wings, yes. and it gives your oil a chance to heat up. And uh, so then we're yes. going to. That's okay. There we go. I got that's it. That's good. I got it. I got so it. then we're going to put these in the fridge. Then we're going to make the sauce. We're going to fry them, and then we're going to eat them. Yeah. Okay. All right. I'm so excited. These I guys are ready to go in. Okay. We got our, our big old fryer. Woo wee. She is ready. She's, She's heated up she, to 350. She, she wants all of it. She does. So, okay, I'm going to go ahead and get going on this sauce. I'm just going to cook this low and slow. I got a third a cup of unsalted butter here that I'm putting into my saucepan um, over medium heat. And uh, you don't have to let that butter completely melt. Uh, it will melt. I'm going to go ahead and add a third a cup of hot sauce, of cayenne hot sauce. Frank's is the one we love to use, and that's pretty traditional. Oh, Frank. Frank. All right, put these over here. And then um, I'm going to add just another little, uh, add that garlic powder, I think just adds a little depth of flavor. I got a half a teaspoon there. Put just a small pinch of black pepper and a pinch of uh, salt, and I'm going to turn this down. And then just let this cook on low. And um, Okay, this is set at 350. That oil is nice and hot. I'm going to have to do two batches, but I'm going to lower this boil. Lower the boom box. There we go. There we go. And so those are, only gonna, those are going to fry for about 11 minutes, and then uh, we'll do the other batch, and then it's wing time. Yeah. <laughs> I am, I am beside myself. I'm so excited. So I, look at these beautiful, what? I'm sorry. No, I, I know, I know, I know. Um, okay, so we got our crispy wings here. That We did them in two batches. Uh, they went for 11 minutes. Uh, brought them out of the oil, kind of let the oil drip off. And then we recommend putting them on uh, like a baking sheet with paper towels. Just let them drain yeah. a little bit. And then do the other batch. And um, here they are in the bowl. Yes, and I've got my, and those things are crispy. I know, they're crispy. And I've got my sauce. I, just, I warmed it. So this is a nice warm sauce. And this is my. Oh, crispy. I've said it over and over and over. This is my favorite thing in the world to do. Wow. I mean, this is what started all, folks. I mean, these are just so, the smell. It's so crazy. You know, it's such a, it's a simple recipe, but, you know, who thought of it? Who thought of it? There's a whole story yeah. behind it, and I'm not going to begin to say, say it because <laughs> I'll be told how wrong I am on it. It's, but there is a story about how this these came to be. Look at those. And, um, okay, that is so All right, so come gorgeous. on. Let's just make a let's, nice plate of them here. Let's do it. And, uh, oh, I got my celery. I've got my blue cheese. So this is our homemade blue cheese dressing. Yes. Uh, I'm telling you, it really, if you can make the blue cheese dressing, it just, if you're going to do wings like this, which you absolutely should, <laughs> I would strongly suggest making the homemade blue cheese. I got room over here. It's too. easy to do, and it's, um, it's delicious. And it really is, it's just incredible. And you all can right. use it for a wedge salad, too. You could, and we do that <laughs> all the time. All right, they, they're soaked up most of that. Yes. That good old buttery. Uh, Come on. There we go. Let's not be chintzy. No. Okay. All right, it is time. It is the moment we have been waiting for all of our lives. <laughs> I got a plate finally. <laughs> I know, we eat wings and we're just like, oh, I guess we should have a plate. Yeah, I need a plate because we dig right in. I know. Like we're going to do right now. Um, wow. Okay, well, I, um, I'm just going to. Ooh, -wee. Oh boy. Look at that. I'm going to grab a. You know, I'm going to put my. I'm going to put my. Uh, so you guys can see me. Just drown it. I'm going to. He. he Plunges. Plunge. I like to apply. Plunge, baby. He's and we have plunge. our own individual, so I can get it as messy as that's I want That's right, to. that's right. Oh, Chris. I'm so excited. Okay, here we go. Mmm. 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 That's the real deal. I mean, that, you know, you just, I mean, they're the stars. I mean, you know, uh, uh, oh. Oh, I get why <laughs> everyone started doing wings after these came into creation. Oh. Thank you. Those are amazing. I'm going to eat your face oh, off <laughs> in one sitting. These are so, so oh. good. I don't know. <laughs> and the frying is just like perfect. It's yeah. just crisp them um, up. Just ready for that you sauce. Could, you could do these in the oven. You could do them in an air fryer. 
But if you're gonna do wing, classic wings, I mean, baby, y'all. Fry them up. Fry them up. Y'all, this is, that is 100,000% Luna Proof. I had a feeling. Woo. You guys, making wings are so yeah. much fun. You make wing and take wings yeah, and make take a, flight. A wing on a prayer or a <laughs> for wings. We love you so yeah. much, everybody. We're you winging. You are the wind beneath my wings. Woo! <laughs> make some wings. <laughs>